Asus ZenWatch 2, design and build like the Apple Watch, the ZenWatch 2 comes in two sizes, one measuring 49x41 mm, model number WI501Q, with a 22 mm strap, and a 45x37 mm model, WI502Q, that sits on an 18 mm strap. The bigger one has a 320x320 resolution, 278 ppi, while the smaller version's ppi count of 273 is from a 280x280 panel. There are a plethora of strap options, a leather strap is available in khaki, brown, grey, blue, and orange, there's a trio of stainless steel link bracelets, and ASUS has also teamed up with Swarovski for a leather strap with an embossed crystals. The displays are the same 2.5D curved mold ones that we saw on the original Zen watch, covered in Gorilla Glass 3, and the only real design change is the addition of a standby button on the side, in the form of a watch dial. Running on Android Wear, the Zen Watch 2 also taps into ASUS existing smartwatch ecosystem with apps like Phone Helper, Activity and Fitness Tracking with ASUS Wellness, and Remote Camera all offer. Remote Camera, which turns a smartwatch into an viewfinder, has been improved for the sequel with faster performance, more range, the ability to switch between the phone's front and rear cameras, and zoom skills. Earlier this year it was reported that the ASUS Zen Watch 2 will boast a 7-day battery life. Talking to reporters in Taiwan, the company's chairman Johnny Shi said, as a companion device, its central processing unit and operating system should be more simplified than the current version, so that I can use it for up to seven days on one charge, rather than for just two days. However, the news is that, while the battery life has been boosted, we're looking at a life cycle of around two days, not a full week. The bigger size option does come with a chargeback accessory for extra juice though, and charging is easier thanks to the new magnetic cable. The Asus Zen Watch 2 is powered by a Qualcomm Snapdragon processor and the water resistance has been bumped up to IP67, which means it can survive a 1M dunking for 30 minutes.